How's it going, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. I'm Enrique CTV, and today we are watching episode two of season two of Made in the Abyss. Uh, it was a weird start. It was a hot start. I'm very, very curious um, where this is going to go now because the movie was so good. The first episode was so different and so good, and just I didn't think it would go back that far. It was just a really shocking kind of change but also a welcome one. It was something I didn't know the show needed, but it felt very good to just kind of go back for a second and see what essentially is the start, or at least a start of the journey of the abyss. Um, clearly the people that were already there at Orth, um, before it became Orth, uh, knew some stuff, spoke a different language, but they knew something about the abyss, about what it did. And these adventurers were starting to figure it out, and most of them survived to get to the capital of the Unreturned. So now we kind of just have to figure out what's going on. Um, we just made it there. It looked really cool. Uh, and I'm just curious to see if we're going to keep doing these parallels or if we're going to actually see these people we met. But yeah, I'm, I'm very, very excited. I'm locked in. I'm ready to go. So let's, uh, let's watch the next episode. A golden city where things beyond humans live. This looks crazy. I can't wait to see what this does. It kind of reminds me of a different type of, um, like, crumbling Faramazula. The shining one versus a gray and dead one. Ooh! Traps! Watch out! Oh, what a snag by Reg. Is there just, are they on top of a building? Dude, wow. Yeah, I just saw that. I'm like, what? It's really weird that this has to be part of whatever happened to create, create maybe, I guess, the abyss. It looks like all these buildings got just like, yeah, like swallowed and just taken over by, uh, by the earth. New opening looking crazy. This aerial shot's nuts. <laughs> Normally I skip the opening, but this is very interesting. It's very different. Just from the opening alone, it seems like they're going to be doing a lot of parallels. I don't think we're going to meet these people, but I think we're going to see their journeys. This looks, this looks like it's going to be a crazy ass season. Oh, God damn. A lot of flows of conscious. Oh, shit. Are these people actually going to be here? Are they still here? Are they still breathing and alive somehow? What are these things? Are these just birds? Bird things? <laughs> Switching it to, to team leaders? Different leader? Nice. Now this, this place literally it does just not look like anything we've seen at all yet. This is crazy. It seems like there's a lot to find here. As opposed to everything else we've seen, for sure. That is true. We oh, what is that? Is that a different version of the Corpse Sweeper? Holy shit. Urban and Dragon? Oh my god. Holy shit. Big pass. Let's not talk to that thing. What are that? Oh, they look so stupid. <laughs> well, are they good? Oh, all right, sweet. Grabbing some eggs, excuse me. Oh, unless they're in there. Yeah, they are. This is a cooking show. They look like snails. Um, what is behind you? What the fuck? Why is Nanaji the only one that seems to be actually terrified by that? Like, what? Why would you not be scared by that? That's just an explosion. What the fuck? Holy shit, get inside! Ooh. Oh my god, is Nanachi okay? What? What are these things doing? Is that what they just saw? That, like, giant dra turpinate dragon? Holy shit. Just keeps happening? Oh. Geothermal nests. Okay. Oh my god. 
Yo, I love Rico's like, yeah, she just, why does it sound like she's enjoying this? She looks like so excited about it. But like, she's so worried about the food, but like literally you could die. It's all fun and games until she's literally like on fire melting. Oh my god, what? Is it gonna be like octopus like when you when you cut live octopus like the tentacles can like still move away from the plate? He's just gonna go after it. <laughs> he doesn't care. He's not gonna die. Oh! He won. He's not gonna tell her that it's gonna move in her mouth. What is? What are they gonna do? Oh my god! They're gonna fry him. Get the fuck out. Ew! Why is it still doing it? I hate it. It's just probably like fried chicken, but like I'm so mad that it's doing that. Oh, that's adorable. She's just going in on some food. Classic. A lot of food loving in this. It's probably just similar to like fried chicken, yeah? The orphanage, what do you get? Nah, dude, I wanna be alright. Hope the kid do, kid's chilling. I wonder if Kiwi's okay, by the way. Uh, he looks angry. <laughs> I do... I don't know about all of them, but I am worried about Kiwi. Because of the whole birthday situation. Because if he goes back to the the abyss, to the pit, city, or the city pit, um, like what'll happen? That is, yeah, we did, we did make it to the bottom, but will it even make it up top? It's going to go into the water, isn't it? <laughs> Rico. <laughs> uh, it is a little boring. Like anyone could come way down here to get us. Yeah, that's true. At this point, it's over. I hope it. Uh, I hope it doesn't. Odds of a male balloon reaching them from this low. It is, it is low. Yeah. It's hard. And I hope I hope it did. Well, I know it got up there, but I hope this gets up there. It's true, but it has to balance itself out, right? Curses and blessings. You gotta be careful with those. You never know, dude. It can go any way you want. Get the fuck out. <laughs> <laughs> That's nuts. They were just like, oh, good shit. Loser, like just pointing down at him. Ha, <laughs> fucking stupid. Just bullying these kids. Oh, the abyss. So fucking wild. Oh, I'm, I'm not a big fan of these things, like watching them and whatever. Like, things are smart down here. They could probably get past his traps, right? Like, let's be real. Oh my god, you just sniffing the tail. He's just like, mm. Who drew on that? Who do what the... What the fuck? Somebody got the thing back. What is Prushka? Oh, damn! What? Is that what they were talking about? Like, the... What? Aww, poor Rico. But... What the fuck? Iron. What? That's weird. No, I think they want you to find them, clearly. But they need to, I mean... The fact that they took Prushka, that's crazy. Like, how important is a white whistle here? Can, and nobody else can use it, right? So, I mean... That that arm got to hold out real tight, considering it's two instead of one now. That's nuts. That's my boy. That's my boy, Rig. Maybe he's finding some dead things. I would follow the person that knows what's going on, but... That looks like somebody fucked with that thing. Yeah, what did you expect would be- Ew! Oh, never mind! What the fuck is in there? What the f- 
This is that's gross. What? What? Who are who is this person that's doing this? What could they possibly be? They shoved it up their ass though, or like made it eat it. What the fuck? <laughs> I, I'm fucking. I, what the hell is happening? We knew that eventually some crazy shit like this would happen. That like something that is just nobody could even deal with is here. Whatever that is, is fucking huge, bro. Oh my god. Can they go back and forth? Like become big and small and change somehow? Because that's the only way it would have been able to get past the traps, right? Yo, they really did that to show how big it is. Oh my god. Ooh, these are just normal ass ruins. Kind of. Oh, jeez. This looks nuts. That looks so cool. Who made this, though? To get over there. It also looks like an upside down tree. Oh, it's the same. Same sign. Oh, okay. I thought it was like her upside down. Oh my god. Break. Re get off of her. Relax. Alright, good. Because the strains would kill you at this point. Holy shit. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my gosh. What are they gonna do? How are they gonna do this? Oh, it's just like smoking it out? Potentially? It definitely, I mean, they're making themselves known. What? You heard? Did he not hear? Oh, she did hear. Okay, I was like, say. There's no way she didn't hear that. Ooh. Okay. That, that was great. going to shit at me for a second. That thing is fast. Interesting. There's something. There's an invisible wall. Could it be blocking out the curse? Oh, please don't burn him. Just like. Oh. Okay. <laughs> nice. This looks dope. I love this setting. Yeah, dude. No. No, no, no. That's gross. I hate this. It looked really cool for a second, and then I realized how gross it is. I wonder if the strains are affected within here because of the force field or that little thing. Because if they gotta go back up there, that's kind of that's a little bit of a uphill, you know? They're gonna uh, turn into a blob, maybe up there. I hope not. Eee, what the fuck are those things? What could these possibly be? Is that Liza? <laughs> Holy shit! What the fuck is that? A doll of some sort? There's somebody in the middle. It's a robot! And What? That's, that doesn't... We, we don't know anything about anything. Holy shit. Magikaja? Holy shit. Brought what? I am so confused. This is nuts. What is happening? What is happening? There are so many things that is this just like. Oh, wait, what the fuck does that mean? Are these humans? Yo! <laughs> oh my god. I gotta tell you, I mean, this is not where I thought this was going at all. I was expecting like humans to be here and maybe they are humans. Maybe that's what they are. Maybe they're real ass humans, but they're just totally not anymore. Uh, maybe their outer shell is different. If that is the case, then holy shit. Because I was just, they look, that looks like a robot. The, some of the others look like dolls and like stitched up like stuffed animals. And like, if that's how you, just what you turn into, 
it would it's I, I just would love to see the process because I don't know how that would I don't know how that makes sense you know what I mean we know that the abyss obviously fucking nuts and MIDI makes sense like turning into this blob of meat that you are makes sense I don't know if maybe the like clothes affects how you what you turn into maybe like it's hard to talk about something when you don't know everything obviously it's just this is exactly what this show has always been and it's just doing it better every episode the further you go into it the more questions you somehow get when you get something answered all of a sudden you get another thing that you're wondering about and it's it's crazy there's just so many questions to be had there's a lot of things constantly like being brought up that you don't even really think about just like all the ruins the different types of biomes everything in the abyss everything about this past way 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 long about you know civilization is just so confusing and mysterious and just there's so many holes in this story that not we get but the characters get and what the characters know may not actually be correct and may not actually make complete sense and it's just it's it just builds on this existing crazy world and pit that just may is just i don't know it's <laughs> it's just so much while also being like right in your face somehow i just can't imagine that there's a clear answer that is just a one answer thing it's definitely like a whole progress a whole just explanation and, and just there's more to it for sure than what meets the eye and probably case by case even it could be different for every person it could be different for every group or whatever um we didn't get anything of that first group that we saw in the first episode um but after watching the intro it seems like we're gonna get a lot of them um it seems like they're gonna be heavily involved in one way or another. Uh, I don't know, like I said, I after watching the intro, I don't know if we're gonna meet them or that we're gonna just keep getting those parallels. It was a very good intro in terms of me trying to figure out what the fuck's going on because I didn't know what was going on. And those are good intros. When you have no idea what's happening, it's great. Um, if you've never read any of it, if you don't know what's gonna go down later on and you're watching it for the first time, it's good. I have no idea what's happening. I'm sure later I'll be like, oh, I knew this, I saw that, and like, it's whatever. But right now, I could not gather anything from that intro. I'm sure if I looked it over and tried to like really nitpick, I'd figure it out, but I'm not going to. Thank you guys for watching. That's gonna be it for me. Please like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for every time I post a main of this video. I post every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, so please look forward to these. Uh, I'm having a really good time, and I love the show so far. The music also, by the way, chef's kiss to Kevin every time. So good. I need this whole soundtrack in my phone. Uh, but yeah, peace out, guys. Bye.